I don't know what to do, Lena. I, I need you. I, I mean, we need you back here. Moving to Caspin, they can't do that. I can't even see her anymore. I can't do this. I have to do something. Guys, we can't let King Cyrus come in and take everything he wants. Lena's meant to be with us. I'm going to save her. And how are you planning on getting past Caspin's guards? Look, Alexander, I know it's hard, but I don't know if going to King Cyrus and demanding Lena back is the best idea. I can't let him get away with this. I'll fight the guards off. I'll make it through. You? Against the entire Caspin army? Alexander, no offense, you're good, but you're not that good. Hawk's right. Caspin's army has you outnumbered by the thousands. Alexander, I think you need to take a better approach to your plan. I think he shouldn't go at all. He could easily get hurt or worse, killed. But it would be a romantic move to save his girlfriend. Girlfriend? girlfriend? <laughs> Lena is not my girlfriend, just a friend who I happen to care very deeply about. And I only wish her happiness, which is why I have to get her back. Well, you could always kill Prince Philip. Which would lead to war on Veron anyways. Yeah, I'm not too sure how happy King Cyrus will be about that. I'm not killing a friend. Alexander, we can't do anything. I know this hurts you, but- But what? I thought you guys cared about Lena. We do, but we can't just barge into Caspin and steal Lena away. Guys, please, I need your support if I'm going to do this. There ain't no way you're going to get me to run into Caspin to fight the guards. I don't have a death wish. <sighs> Nicholas? Lena's like a sister to me. I'd want to do anything to help her. But I still have Phoebe to worry about. Someone needs to be around to take care of her, Alexander. I'm sorry. Anne, please help me. I'm sorry, Alexander. Hi, honey. Hello, Lila. I have news. Good, I hope. <laughs> well, as you know, Philip has had some... trouble in finding his queen. I know. It's a shame. I just want to be there for his wedding. Well, Philip has finally chosen a maiden. Really? I'm so proud of him. From what kingdom? Veron. Veron? So a sister of Lionel? I never knew he had a sister. It was just recently discovered. They apparently grew up separated from each other. From what I hear, she didn't even know she was royalty until a few weeks ago. I'm surprised Philip didn't tell me he had an interest in the maiden himself. Oh, well, I'm sure he just wanted to make sure things went well before he told you. I know he wouldn't want to break your heart, dear. I suppose that's fair. When's the wedding? Tomorrow. I believe he's trying on suits as we speak. I'll go see him now, then. But no, no, my dear, you need to stay and rest. Honey, I'm fine. I've been resting so much already. A little walking will be good for me. I'm sure he's very busy, honey, please. Come and stop me, then. Lila! Oh! Oh! Oh, my back! Oh, gods! <coughs> Why do none of these feel right? You look very handsome, son. Mother, what are you doing out of bed? I heard you were trying on suits. I had to come see. Mother, you're sick. Please, go back to bed. I'm so proud of you, Philip. You've grown so much. Mother, please. Philip, I'm okay, I promise. I'm so happy you're getting married. Mother, I- I've waited so long for this. I've wanted so bad to be at your wedding, see the beautiful bride you've chosen, a kind, caring maiden who loves you and who you love. Someone who will take my place in ruling over Caspin along your side. I love you, mother. I love you too, Philip. I know your father can be hard and pushy, but it's just because he loves you too. He wants to see you get married. I'm so happy you've finally chosen a girl. I can't wait to meet her. Please go back to bed, mother. I want to show, Philip. Being in bed is so boring. Show me the options. <laughs> Alright, look, I'll go get you a chair. I'll be right back.
This one is nice. Ooh, <laughs> I like this one. <laughs> Thank you for that, Philip. I really enjoyed our time together. Oh, I'm sorry I've been so busy lately. I haven't gotten to spend much time with you. Philip, you visit me every day. Plus, you're getting married soon. That's a tedious, time-consuming project on its own. Are you sure you're okay, Mother? I'm more than okay. I got to spend time with my favorite son. I'm your only son. Still my favorite. <laughs> Alright, well... I enjoyed spending time with you, too. Queen Lila, King Cyrus is requesting you get more rest before Philip's big day. Ah, <sighs> I understand. Good luck, Philip. Oh, mother. Hey, guys. Has anyone seen Alexander? Nope. You try the guard's quarters? Duh! The stables? Yeah! And his horse Sebastian is missing! Do you guys think he actually went after Lena? All the way to Caspin? Alone? That's a death march. I don't know where else he'd be going. If Alyssa finds out Alexander is gone, she's gonna go berserk. That girl is scary. What do we do, guys? Do about what? C C commander hi! Hey, Alyssa. What are you three gossiping about? Uh, nothing. We were just talking about what to train on. Wanted to get some more work in before nightfall. Ah, well then. Why don't you use the stables? While you're at it, clean it up for me. I was gonna get Alexander to do it, but I can't find him anywhere. Uh, oh, well. Oh, well, you see. Uh, c commander um, a Alexander has been feeling very ill today. Uh, he's been in the quarters all day. Oh, I should go check on him then. No, um, you can't, Commander. He's, uh... Super contagious. You know, coughing, runny nose, the works. Best to stay away. We can't have our top commander getting sick after all. I see. Thank you. Well, if you see him, please give him my regards. Uh, we will. Oh, well, uh, we best be on our way now. Lots of cleaning and training to be done. Yes, thank you, Commander. Come on, Hawk! See ya, Commander. Those three are definitely up to something. Well, I should probably get back soon. I've got the next shift card in the new fancy princess the king's kid is marrying. Breviet! Uh, I'm not sure you're supposed to be in here, son. This place is just for the guard. <laughs> Finally! I've been waiting for you to show up for ages now. What took so long? Uh, sorry. I was having some, uh, stomach issues. Oh, jeez. Well, we've all been there, I guess. See you later. Um, can I help you, sir? Hi, Lena. Alexander! I've missed you so much! I've missed you too. I'm here to bring you back to Varan. How did you get in here? Intuition. 
that and a lot of dumb luck. Alexander, thank you, but I can't come with you. What? Why not? You don't actually want to marry Philip, do you? Alexander, if I were to leave now, King Cyrus would destroy all Veron. It's my job as the Princess of Veron to protect its people. Lena, please come with me. Alexander, I can't. Lena, I can't leave without you. You don't need me, Alexander. It's okay. You're not my guard anymore. You're not responsible for me anymore. Lena, you don't understand. Ever since the ball, I can't stop thinking about you. With you gone, I feel like I'm missing something. I can't do this without you. Please, Lena, you can't marry him. Alexander, I... I'm sorry, Alexander. Guards, help! Lena, why?